Here's example five for parabolas with a focus and directrix. Given y minus six squared equals 16 times x plus four, state the coordinates of the vertex, focus, and directrix. And then we have to sketch. So the first thing I notice is that it's a y squared. So I know it's gonna open either to the right or to the left, because those are my two options. Now, our equation is usually y squared equals 4px. So whatever's next to the x is the 4p. So here's my 4p. In my equation, there's my 4p. So 16 equals 4p. So I can now solve for p. So I divide both sides by 4. So p equals 4. So I have a positive p, so that tells me right or left, my positive numbers are on the right, so that's the direction this is going to open. So now I want to sketch my picture. So in order to sketch my picture, I need the vertex. And remember, the vertex is what goes with x and y, but it's the opposite. So my vertex is going to be negative 4, positive 6. So negative 4, positive 6, there's my vertex. And I know that it opens to the right, so I'm going to sketch my picture. Now, I have my vertex. I now need my focus and my directrix. So remember, P is your distance. So I'm going to count four units in each direction. So I'm going to count four units to the right, and I'm going to count four units to the left. The focus is inside, so that's this point here. And then the four units to the left is my directrix because that's on the outside. So remember, your focus is a coordinate point. So this is the point 0, comma, 6. And your directrix is an equation. So this is the equation x equals, because we went to the left, and the x's are on the left. And we moved four units to the left, so it's x equals negative 8. So there are the pieces that they wanted me to identify. And we obviously sketched our parabola as well.